Good morning. Good morning. So it's nice and early. It is oh, uh, 6.54. So we did get up at 10 to 5 this morning. And we are at Bell's Rapids in Brigadoon. So sure. We're going to go check out the rapids um, and check out the waterfall. I believe that they do so, the Avon descent. That's it, down this river. We will not be going in the river today. It's too cold. <laughs> so we'll see you out there. We wanted to see the sun come up over the Darling Ranges, so we headed off from home nice and early. Bells Rapids Park is located in the Upper Swan Valley and it's part of the Swan River. All right, you ready for a wonder? Ready to get going, let's yeah. go. Rapids form one of the most popular spectator vantage points for the Avon Descent race. Just across the river is a great walking trail called Goat Walk. It's a bit muddy through here. A bit soggy. <laughs> These are the types of kayaks that are used in the Avon Descent Race. The race had just been completed a couple of weeks before we went up to Bells Rapids.
After our walk around the river, we headed over to check out Bell's Waterfall. The path to the waterfall has a no trespassing sign on it because it's railway land, but you can walk out to the falls, no problems. I'm not jumping on that slippery rock. Why not? Because I'll go after it. Ah. So we've come up the trail past the no trespassing sign to get to where the waterfall is and we're almost there but it appears we've come up the wrong side so now somehow we've got to get across this without pitching it Springtime is a great time to head out in the Perth Hills. The wildflowers are truly beautiful. Well, we've just finished our little walk up to the waterfall at uh, Bell's Waterfall and it was actually quite a lovely little walk. The track is probably a little bit more tricky than what we expected, but uh, it's actually worth it when you get there. What do you think, Chas? It's way worth it, <laughs> yes. And I did a little bit of a stack in the creek, but... Oh, what happened? Oh, only one foot. One of the rocks when I was crossing this river crossing was a bit loose and so yeah. Unfortunately, I didn't go completely ass up. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit of entertainment for me, though. Always. <laughs> uh, we're making our way back to the car, and we're going to see how the rest of our day pans out. So we've just taken ourselves for a little bit of a quick drive down the road. We've um, left Bells Rapids and we've now made our way across to Noble Falls, another little tourist attraction just outside of Perth near Gijigana and uh, we're going to take you for a little bit of a quick look around and we're going to check this place out for you as well. sure if you as children did it, I know I did. We used to pull them off and chomp on the ends of them. Very sour. Sour lollies, what are you talking about? We used to just go into the bush and eat the, eat the plants.
So that's our little walk around Noble Falls. We hope you like that. It's a beautiful little spot, ideal for maybe um, picnics or something like that, bring the family down. The water in the creek is really nice and clear, so maybe jump in and have a swim on a nice warm day. Lovely spot to come down and check out. Mate, we'll push you in. Yeah, 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 you first. <laughs> Darren. Okay, well, thanks for joining us for another Robin Shaves Travel Adventure. Today's little journey around the Perth Hills, a spring day trip from Perth. And we hope you enjoyed all the footage. It's been a beautiful day for us out on the road. Do you enjoy yourself? Sure did. Excellent. Now off home to put it all together. All right. And we'll see you in the next Robin Shaz Travel Adventure. Thanks again for watching our Rob Shaz Travel Adventures. Be sure to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of our new videos.